First cast of the day. That water even looks like it got more clear since yesterday. Could just be because of the sun too though. This is what I'm using right here. Gold lead head with a Largo shad. Perch colored. It's a weird recording with this thing on my head. <laughs> We're out at one of our uh, better bass spots that we know of anyways. Water's looking pretty clear. Andrew lost a hog yesterday, just right off that corner where he's at now. It's the first time I've used the head mount for a long time, so I think the last time I used it was when I lost my uh, my Hero 5 surfing in Costa Rica. So I hope the footage is pretty decent. Usually is. Try to use the head mount over the chest mount, but. You gonna redeem yourself after that? I think I just got a bite. Yeah, I just had a bite right there. Missed one. There's one. Walleye, baby. Nice walleye. I watched him hit it too. That's a good looking walleye. No, 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 no. Dude, that's a stud. Yeah, it's not bad. Dude, that is a eater. Eater. Dude, let me see that. Dude, that is a stud, man. Look at Hell this. Hell yeah. That's a juicy looking mm. walleye right there. Look at that gold, man. Gold. Is it by my camera? Yup, yup, yup. Look at this bad boy. Dude, Should I just let him, I'm gonna let him go, I think. Birds. We don't have a stringer, so. Yeah, it's not the wrong man. That's a stud, man. <sighs> Hell yeah. Hell yeah, let's go. Was looking for a bass and got a walleye. Caught a walleye somehow. All right, I'm gonna go grab my tackle box quick, I think. There it is. Sweet. Only if everything in life for that easy. I try either this little guy or maybe a little spinner. I don't know. Actually, this might actually be pretty good, but we're not going to use this color of lead head. What I'm going to do is, we're just going to do the sw old switcheroo ski on the shad. Take off the algae. Put this back. And then, had a lot of luck with these split tail worms, the white ones in particular. Just run it through the back. Well, boom. So the hook's barely, this hook's a little bent, but she'll still work. Let's see how that works. Oh yeah. I think that white's gonna stick out pretty good too because of how clear the water is. Water hasn't been this clear for years, like I said earlier, and 
I don't know. It's just crazy. Remember water. Always. Always. Don't want to be out here catching fish and get dehydrated. fooled me. He got me good. Yeah, Andrew missed probably a, I hate to rub it in, but he missed probably a, it's probably a four pound bass yesterday. I mean, that's just all speculation, but I've seen three pounders. I've never, uh, I've seen a four pounder in my last video. There was a guy that caught a four pounder down at Nelson and that thing was probably just as big so today is redemption day for him he'll get a fat one oh something's falling something's falling maybe I should step back I don't want to definitely don't want to spook him God, today is just a tremendously nice day. No wind, all sun, water super clear, attitudes are in check. Attitudes always in check. Wouldn't that be something to get that on footage for you guys is a fish hitting pretty shallow, that'd be, I had that yesterday, but my uh, GoPro is at home, so rookie mistake on my part. So I got to reel in a lot quicker than I really want to, but look at that thing. Ooh, I'd eat it. Somebody put that on a plate with some butter, I'd eat it. 100. <laughs> Andy! Snag master. Towards this rock right here comes out and there's bigger rocks and then it drops off right there and I think there's fish that sit right up against that wall where those two big rocks are. This spot usually produces pretty good fish though. Walleye, bass, pike, you name it, marlin, spearfish. That is a massive, massive, oh, that's a carp. That's a carp and a giant bass. Oh yeah, baby. We're gonna hit him, we're gonna hit him right here, watch. Guaranteed, something's gonna want that. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Oh. Oh no, I didn't wanna skip that. A little bit more this time. I thought it was a big pike I saw, it was a carp. I was like, that's a giant pike. No, it's a carp. That'd be pretty fun to get a, some carp footage. Yummy. All right, we're gonna let this, we're gonna let this bad boy sink to the bottom. Yeah, I've seen some big ones patrolling. Some pigs patrolling the area. <laughs> the pike hit it and he missed it. Completely missed. There's one. Hell yeah. Oh, you got off. Let's hope he hit it again. <laughs> oh boy. 
See if we'll get them back, get them on land this time. That was, that was cool. I, I did get one with uh, from hitting it right at shore. Oh, I think it's all screwed up. Oh, there we go. I got it. That was kind of cool. I think there's a fish after it again. That's funny. Something's going to pick it up again. Guarantee it. Can't resist that worm. There's one. A little bass. Barely hooked him. Man. Let's uh set this down quick. Just a little dink, probably like six to eight ounces. Pretty cool. Putting the GoPro back on my melon. And we'll let this, oh. Let this little guy go. Oh, yeah, he darted. Big time. Well, that was cool. There's one. Not bad, not bad. Not bad. On the little red spoon ski. Decent. That's all I'm using is just this little guy here. Just this little 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 red spoon. Meant. Not bad, right? Yeah, not bad. Dude, I knew, yeah, my my shoe, my shoe is soaked right now. I knew he was gonna do that. Dude. What a square wet shoe, ha! <laughs> yeah, maybe I should go grab my tackle box. There's one. Feels like a dink. It's a dink. Ooh, he... Well, you know. If that ain't a dink, I don't know what is. Mimi Mint. So last night we came here yesterday and about this time I was really doing good at this spot. Just left and right getting bites, hooking into fish. for days though. I'd be lying if it said it wasn't frustrating. But it is. But it is. We're gonna hook into a big one here soon. I can feel it.
There's one. Let's go. Hit it right to shore. <gasps> Did he shake my... No, he didn't. He just, uh... He just swallowed it. All right, buddy. Trying to get that hook out as best I can without messing him up. Another little dink, but not bad. Make sure I'm recording. Yeah, he definitely didn't like that. I'm about to call it a night. It's about just about nine o'clock. Sun's about to go down. I caught about five fish, a couple bass, a walleye, and a little pike. Well, the pike got off, but it counts. Still counts. Just want to say thanks for watching guys uh don't forget to subscribe like comment anything that you may have thought i could have done better in the video or just some constructive criticism would help any comments say what you want to say criticize me no don't be mean but we're about to head out um <clears throat> Got a pretty good video coming here at the end of the month. We're going to Glacier uh, the 25th of May, so here in like a week. I'll post that as soon as we get back. I'm getting a drone before we go, and uh, yeah, just want to say thanks for watching, and uh, hopefully, you guys made it to the end of the video. Bye!